Jack. This is Ewan, our mascot, Loki. Good boy. We're heading out towards Stack Polly in the Northern Highlands. We're gonna get a bit of an adventure today, first of the year, which will be good. You looking forward to it? We've uh, also got our fly rods. Get a couple of cheeky, sneaky casts in if we got time. Hopefully catch something. We're not expecting to catch much because it's still very early in the year, uh, January. So um, fingers crossed. But it's been unseasonably warm of late, so the water should be a little bit warmer than normal for the time of year. And we might get a chance for a pollock on the fly, or even a shitty coley. Sorry, we swore. No swearing. Um, so yeah. Basically that's it, this is uh, obviously van life fishing, the first of many videos to come I hope. Uh, no van as of yet, because we're just obviously waiting to get the van sorted. Vans should be here for, for the summer season, so there'll be lots of good adventures when, with the third guy who's unfortunately not here today, shout out to Whittle. And yeah, peace out, we'll see you at Stack Valley. cruising now into our net. Funky little place. It's a place that we actually quite like to fish a lot. Um, I'll tell you that because it's no secret that you catch some tiddly weeny sea trout here. So anyway, without further ado, I'll leave you to enjoy the view. The big beak sticking up, that's Stack Polly, that's where we're heading up before we get a few hours of fishing in. We're just going for a one because it's a nice day. Hopefully you enjoy the video. If you do, give us a thumbs up, like. Um, feel free to comment as well, by the way. Um, we'll try to get back to any comments that you, do, you guys do send. And uh, yeah, welcome to the West Coast. is the best side. Way better than the east. East is beast, but west is best. Best of us. <laughs> Well guys, unfortunately because of the wind at the top of the hill, it, the GoPro didn't pick up the volume very well, so I'll just give you a quick run through the jet boil itself. Now, my gas was running quite low, so it didn't boil as quick as normal. Um, normally it takes about three, three minutes roughly to boil up. It took me just, just under 10 minutes. Um, 
again with the wind, a little bit of wind at the top of the hill and the fact the gas was running quite low, it's no surprise it took a little bit longer than normal. But the point is it still worked, it still boiled the water, it's a great little thing to have in your bag. Um, if you are going out for weekend camping trips, weekend walking trips, weekend hikes, um, you know, if you're going out for a period of time, if you're going on boffy breaks, anything like that, it's certainly a piece of kit I would advise having in your pack. It doesn't take up much room. Um, in total, it, it's about, well, I'd say about six to eight inches uh, tall. Um, maybe about three to four wide uh, so yeah no bigger than a bottle of water really um, and it certainly is something that I highly recommend having um, it certainly does work wonders um, as you can see from the video Stack Polly, we've had a good check, lungs stretched, it's me and Ewan, and we are heading down to a secret fishing spot. I'll turn the camera off in a minute because I don't really want to give away where we are, and if I turn the camera around in a minute, those of you who know up here will probably see that and know where we are. So, we'll put the camera back on, just to let you know, we're, we're not doing things the normal way, we've got fly rods. January, the water's probably still quite cold. People are wearing coats and hats still, but we're not because we're idiots. And yeah, we're, we're not expecting much, but we'll see. Feels like rust into your soul. Stay 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 Under the bright sky. Well, unfortunately guys, there were no fish today. Um, we tried. Um, it's you know, obviously been January, it's cold, the water's not quite as warm as it should be and we were fishing for what up here tends to be a summer species um, in, in January with fly rods rather than a sort of no or normal gear that we would opt for. Um, you know, that's why it's called fishing and not catching. But what an end to, what a day really. Um, we had a great time going up the hill. The views were phenomenal and, and the weather was, yeah, was very kind to us. Um, and the water itself was 
gin clear as you can probably see from the video um, you know, I did try to get a little bit of underwater footage and didn't quite record as much as I'd like to have done when we were fishing because well I was enjoying fishing um, but I do hope you've enjoyed the video if you have let us know um, there will be more to come and yeah we, you know, thanks very much for watching See you later, bye. enjoyed the video like and subscribe feel free to comment ask us any questions we'll try to get back to it I'm sure you know some of you might have questions no, no.